Hello everyone and welcome to my hair text tutorial. Um, for those of you who don't know, this is hair text. In fact, I don't even know if it's even called that. Um, I'm naming it that. Why? I don't know. It just, it looks like hair text to me, so. As you can see, I have a little helper. You can tell with my PSP bugging. Jaden is here to help me explain how to cue text. Okay, so enough monkeying around Jaden. We have to finish this. Okay, I'll let you tape the letters. Alright, the first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open a new image on a transparent layer. Oh, great, buddy. Okay. On a transparent layer, um, pick your font, your size. Then you want to set your stroke color, whatever color you want, and your fill color to white. Okay? You also want to set your stroke width to whatever you want. I'm going to be using a stroke width of 3. You can do more or less, you know, whatever you want. Okay, here. You can tape the letters. Okay. Okay, that's too many letters. That'll do. Thank you, little helper, for typing out our word of the day, which seems to be seven kzvug. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> now, um, once you have your text typed out, go ahead to your um, layers palette and right click on your layer, your text layer, and convert to raster layer. Okay? Once you do that, go up to effects. No, you already typed your words. Go up to effects, plugins, go to your iCandy 4000, and go up to Bevel Boss. Okay. And in Bevel Boss, you're going to use these settings Bevel with 9, Bevel Height Scale 50, Smoothness 20, um, Bevel Placement Inside Marquee, Dark and Deep Area 0, and Shade Interior Check. Then you want to set your lighting colors to, I mean, color settings to direction 158, inclination 58, highlight brightness 5, highlight size 100. Your highlight color set to white and your shadow color set to your stroke color. And then go ahead and press OK. And there you go. You have your hued text. Now you can also go ahead and add a gradient glow to that. Um, especially if you used a lower stroke setting. I used three, so if you want to just give it a little bit of a glow, you can just use the same exact color that you used for your outline, for your stroke. I set it very small, and a glow with a five, soft corners 25, and overall opacity 100. And there you have it, your huge text tutorial. I want a special thanks to my little helper. Huh? Little helper, say hi. You don't feel like talking? Now you just want to hit mommy's keyboard. Okay, well I hope this tutorial helped you out. Sorry if it's a little confusing, given that my little helper is a little too much help. <laughs> Alright, well, if you have any questions, let me know, and uh, have fun.